chắc Taking no airplane, taking a slow ride from Bangkok, Moshit, northern bus terminal. Yeah, which you can see there in orange, to Muktaan and then crossing to Laos in Savanakhet. Yeah, that's a nearly 10 hour ride. It's usually very easy to come here, you just take the MRT direction Bangsu and then one station before Bangsu it's named Plang uh, Peng or something like that yeah, just one station before Bangsu you drop off and then you just go straight maybe the JJ market and then you arrive after nearly one kilometer it's maybe 900 meter exactly that said my GPS on Google Maps you arrive here then at the bus station and the buses go here everywhere in the north the east sun yeah you save some taxi money because if you take a taxi over there at Moshit or Jatujak BTS or MRT then I made it first time six seven years ago they charged me 150 baht because they went around the park until they were here and yeah you can save this money just walk maybe 10 minutes yeah one kilometer and then you're here also from the station which is one station before Bangsu MRT and you can have a look if you have some time at the JJ market night market yeah I go now with Sapahan company from the Moshe terminal and it's a VIP bus here yeah? and they have the massage chair here yeah? Okay, it's a little bit dark here, you cannot see, but yeah, that's the red lights there. It's a massage chair, so that's very comfortable. They even have the television here. Yeah, so 10 hours, then I'm moved down from there. I take a other bus to Savannakhet and Laos. Yeah, and the good thing is, they serve you like, uh, like green tea and yeah, just a box for drink. And a food box also, look at that. And that's not what I like. Usually they serve some meat, what I don't like. But they have some salted broad beans. They have the taro filled bun. Yeah. And they have a sandwich. Yeah, I mean it's a cheap ticket and they buy here for nearly 100 baht, some stuff, yeah. <laughs> Not bad, yeah, that's VIP bus. Yeah, so after 10 hours from Bangkok to Mukdan, I arrived here in Mukdan. This is the bus to Savannah Cat Laos. Just across the border, maybe half hour, I guess. We are passing the bridge now from Thailand to Laos. Oh, yeah, well, there's Laos already. The stem now, and now I am officially in Laos and going to the hotel. Yeah, nice to see you. That's a Lao Germany wood factory here. Learning center for disabled or lack of opportunity people. Nice one. Nice to see that it exists here. I'm just sitting in a Savannah Cat restaurant. Nice.
buy some crown glass here. That's a cool pickup here. Look at that monster. Yeah, I like the pickups. Okay, mine is of course not so big like this. Look, this monster tires. Oh, it's very high. It's probably 160, 170. Cool one. You just told me I cannot buy to daily ticket back to Mukhtaan. Only five hours before. So I just have to do that. This is the Songkran edition here from this year, the Buddhist year 2050, 2560. And they made a limited edition of Songkran. 7000 kip. That's something like $1 nearly. Looks cool. Be allowed. So when I get impressions. I see the Olympic rings here, I have no clue why. I can't remember that the Olympic Games were in Lao. There's a monument. Yeah, Olympic rings here. The small garden. Mm, so when I get Laos, yeah, it's small city, not much traffic here. I haven't walked to the Mekong River. It's just in front, maybe 300 meter. Yeah, so I'm now at the river road here, just the Mekong. And yeah, they not take much care here. Maybe over there. They take better care, but yeah, not here. Yeah, it was similar in Vientiane. They made it rice on, uh, nice on one part of Vientiane, and the other part was absolutely undeveloped. Yeah, the Thai side is mostly more developed. Yeah, it's in development here in Laos. Yeah, the Mekong view, beautiful. Beautiful, old style Lao house. Is that Elvis? Sounds like. Near the Mekong house, near the Mekong River. Mekong restaurant. That sounds like Elvis Presley. At the Mekong restaurant and cocktail bar. Maybe, maybe not. There's a line at the Thai embassy. Probably like 50 people here, 2nd of May. It's not a good idea to come after holiday or after Sunday. Alright, I just came from the embassy of Thailand here in Laos. And yeah, what you need is actually a bank statement, yeah, which shows more than 20,000 baht in it, or equivalent value in Euro or US dollar, or whatever currency you have. Yeah, and then of course the visa application, two passport photos, three times four, and yeah, a copy of the passport. Yeah, that's everything. And then you pay 1000 baht, and this can change, of course. But yeah, easy process, wait one day, and then the next day after 2 p.m., you can pick up the tourist visa or whatever visa you want. It needs only one working day till the afternoon, 2 p.m. Yeah, so I just booked in another hotel now and then we'll pick up the visa tomorrow. And now I'm here at the soccer field and so on like that. At least it looks like a soccer field. Maybe they use it in the Olympics. I would really wonder if you were at the Olympics in the year 1961. Yeah, it's dated over there across the gate, uh, above the gate. Yeah, 1961. 
at the Olympics here in Laos. I would really wonder how I check that, we'll check that later. Yeah, I just took the hotel at uh, near the bus station, yeah, in Savannah Cat. And it's 70,000 kip for only fan. Yeah, I don't need essentially the air condition. Air condition would be 90,000, yeah. So that's only the difference of 2 3 euro. So I'm not eager to have it too cool in the night. And if I use the air conditioner, yeah, like in my house, then I just have to turn on and off. And you hear it, yeah? Okay, it might be not too loud, yeah, but yeah, I have sensitive ears, I just hear it. So I hear the fan also, yeah? But it's not like the air conditioner, yeah? That's why when I go somewhere, sometimes I use the air conditioner room, yeah? Sometimes I use the fan room. So. For no specific reason, except that I hear maybe some old air conditions more louder than the fan is. Yeah, so I walk now here to the Mekong River again, near the big Olympic area here. And yeah, near the bus station you find cheap rooms. I've read online even from 30 and 50,000 they have some rooms. They wrote some names but the forum was written uh, four or five years ago, something like that. And yeah, maybe if you look more closer then you can find even cheaper rooms. But yeah, I think 70,000 is it's a good price. It's around eight dollar or nine nine dollar eight euro something like that for fan room and ten dollar or nine euro for the air conditioning room near the bus station yeah over there at the right end is the river I just had to stop here this group just some ladies they gave me the water here it's a soda water near the school so they speak a little bit English, yeah, it's not too much, but a little bit. Yes, they just learned it. I, I remember I learned it also when I was around seven or eight. Yeah, yeah they start here also around this time, they told me. Yeah, I come to this place. Well, yesterday a fish here. Yeah. So maybe only five minutes from the school where I just came from. On the left side of the river, yeah. Sabadi! Yeah, it with her yesterday, the fish. 50,000 kip. Oh. <laughs> oh, my gin. My gin, my gin. Later, I go Buddha, Buddha head. Yeah, I want to see. And make movie. For good memory. Oh, big beer lao, tawai. Oh, sip pan. Ah, sip pan. Oh, later, come back. Evening. Oh. See you. Oh. Yeah, this she has big fish. <laughs> it's very delicious. Mm, how do I mark? Uh -huh. oh. She makes here, like you see. Yeah. Near the river, it's beautiful to sit here. Just go here if you're in Savannah Cat. Have a nice fish. She's a very nice woman. <laughs> a little bit shy maybe. Yeah, very friendly and nice and have a nice fish here. I had a fish in the water, 55,000 kip. Yeah, it's maybe like seven dollars, something like that, six euro. Yeah, here are many. Yeah, awesome. I have some coconuts here. And behind this outside restaurant, there's a temple also. There were many people yesterday because it was Labor Day yesterday, 1st of May. I'm yeah, going out to the Buddha Head. It's nearly opposite of the temple here at the river. 
Sabana Cat. Yeah, that's the temple here at the Sotanu Road. Here were many people yesterday inside with this temple at the river. Yeah, and just the next street left, there's a Buddha head. Yeah, this is Kinali Road. Yeah, it's just beside the river. In front of the Mekong house. You can see this tree here. The big tree. And here you find the Buddha head, like in Ayutthaya. Yeah, in Ayutthaya they have that also. 80, 90 kilometers north of Bangkok. In Thailand and here in Savannah Cat in Laos. They have that also. It's special. I know in Ayutthaya many people go to this ancient city. Once the biggest city in the world, yeah, 400 years ago. Just to see this Buddha head yeah, and the tree. And Savannah Cat has it also. As of course, it's not so famous here. Not many people go here. The most go to Vientiane or yeah, Cambodia maybe. What I miss here a little bit is the nightlife, yeah. I spoke with one person, he said, no, they don't have anything here. Maybe I speak with another one, maybe he knows a little bit better because it was a farang like me. And he's just said, yeah, they offer some girls for ten dollar. Yeah, okay, I mean, I, I'm not come for the girls here. I'm a girlfriend in Thailand. And yeah, in Vientiane they had a loss for ten dollar. Oh, in Kambodja. Yeah, that's beautiful here. Yeah, yeah the Buddha head here in Savannah Cat. If you go here just for visa run or you travel through with this thing here, make a photo. Yeah, that's it, Savannah Cat, yeah, not Ayutthaya. Wow, the Buddha cup in Baume, but Savannah Cat in Laos. All right, now I know it. Yeah, this house beside the Buddha head tree, it's, it's a hotel, yeah, and restaurant. Hotel Mekong. We'll check the price here. Yeah, it starts also from 70,000 with fan and then 90,000 uh, air conditioned room. The Mekong Hotel right beside the Buddha head and in front of the river. They should clean it here more. It's not so clean here. A lot of plastic bags flying around here. Cinema besides Suk Savan, Kavi and Bristol since 1966. Kun Savan Cinema. What? The woman? Who just came outside told me they don't have any movies here. Maybe soon? Yeah, just beside the cinema is a market, yeah. I guess in the night time it's much more life. It's around one o'clock afternoon and yeah, there's not much going on. It's in front of the church, yeah, you see over there. Oh so I like it. There's a that's coming a nice low chin with a nice head. Oh, sun is hot and strong. I sweat. It's cafe here at the corner. Probably will eat something here. Looks new. I have some people inside. What's that here in front of the church? I saw them yesterday. I gave them 2000 kip. Maybe they drive here every day around with the elephant on the car to collect some money for the Buddhist church. It's cafe, yeah, near the church. I have also like bikes for $5 a day, $2 a day. All the bikes from $15 to $15 a day, cheaper in Thailand. When I rent it in Thailand, always 
maximum five euro six dollar per day yeah they have here on the Linz cafe japanese and vegetarian food so because of that i will go inside i like the vegetarian inside the market yeah, i sit here in Linz cafe just ordered some vegetarian green curry and the melon ginger juice ginger is very good for the body it cleans your body has a lot of antioxidants and yeah i can recommend it side allows beer should always have some ginger <laughs> and yeah i just booked the ticket now online for going back tomorrow at eight o'clock from Muktaham to Moshit in the north of bangkok ticket was with fee 618 thai baht and the vip bus yeah with the massage chair and air conditioned and the television and the usb with the option to load any electronic devices and i booked it at want to go asia yeah i came also with them here so i recommend them i want to get want to go asia.com is a reliable company i would say so you can book with them online and they make sure that they send the ticket immediately after the payment is confirmed i paid by paypal and yeah that's easy peasy i just came out from Linz cafe near the church yeah you can see in the background the church and not far direction to the river which you can see there in front is the tourist information center and yeah we'll just go in bought some postcards at the uh, information tourist information center but they don't have stamps and even here at the post office savannah cat they don't have the stamps they say i have to come back tomorrow <laughs> yeah, luckily i'm here still tomorrow so they have to buy some stamps maybe first i remember the woman from the Linz coffee had the stamps so I'll probably go back there I hope she has enough to cover my postcards we'll try that again it's a few meters from the post office it's a beautiful terrace just bought some coconut juice and over there is Muktahan and they have at the hill a big Buddha here as you can see there on the bottom left Big Buddha statue. Yeah, I just spoke with a French man in the post office. Uh, in the tourist information, he said you have to visit the 4,000 islands in Laos. It's really beautiful. He was really impressed. He's doing a bike tour from the south of Cambodia until the north of Laos, all by bike. And he said he's very impressed about the 4,000 islands. It's very beautiful. Yeah, probably later we'll do that in Laos. Yeah, here they have the ferry also. We'll go there after. From Savannah Cat to Muktahan, the Thai side, across the Mekong River. Do you want to make my nail? No, <laughs> I think my nail okay. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Relaxing at the river. She not give up. She wanna make my nail. No, no, she give up. Go <laughs> try. Cop shy, cop shy. Cop shy make fangs. Alright, now she is up. <laughs> I never let me make my nail. I can do that myself. Nice relaxing in a hammock. Tuk tuk with a hammock. <laughs> 
look sunny. Yeah, so I just came out here from this ferry building here where the ferry goes from Mukdahan, uh, from Savanakhet to Mukdahan. But it's not for Farang, it's only for Thai and Lao people. Yeah, they miss some profits here, the ferry service, because I'm sure many would like to experience a little drive with a boat on the Mekong River. Yeah, so whatever, I take the bus tomorrow to Mukdahan. Uh, it's nice here, beside the Christian church near the Mekong River so I just throw in in the letter box my four postcards to Thailand and Europe and yeah waiting to tomorrow just need to print my bus ticket from one to go Asia we'll do it tomorrow because in front of the Thai embassy they have internet service and printing service for only 100 baht per page. I mean it's nearly 10 times more than it is in or even it's more than 10 times yeah it's 12 times more than what I paid for a page in Thailand so they want to have for one page 100 baht yeah what to do eh, if you need it I guess not many people wear, uh, take their printer with them maybe 99.99 percent don't do that some yeah just do it i've heard about one traveler he takes a printer with him <laughs> yeah that was really a exception i guess he was traveling by car okay that's maybe different and he used um, satellite internet yes yeah, so yes yeah, so office in his car yes yeah, so the most don't do it they just have the backpack and necessary things inside and no printer so yeah if you need a printer just opposite of the Thai embassy you find it and just relax here yeah? take some energy oh yeah looks nice here she's preparing very nice stuff for the temple it's beautiful <laughs> It looks beautiful, yeah. <laughs> it's funny now, she's a little bit shy because I feel <laughs> she doesn't like to show her face. Yeah, yeah, it's not important. The important is <laughs> to look at what they do. Beautiful, for the temple. <coughs> she has some coffee. You okay? <coughs> yeah? Okay. Come, Jay. She's watering it. It's beautiful here. Yeah? I made it in Vientiane, running around the temple. The ladies. See, yeah, I see the durian, 53,000 kip. Yeah, that's that's very high in price. Yeah, that's around six, seven euro. That's in Thailand cheaper. The durian, yeah, you get it there for three, four euro. Lottery is a ticket 20,000, yeah. 20,000 kip. That's around 2 euro 50, 3 dollar. So I was not winning, yeah, I just played the numbers. That's the lucky sellers here. <laughs> On the street near the bus station. That's only 5,000, yeah, maybe you try that. Hapan, huh? Hapan kip. Hapan kip, yeah, that's only 5,000 kip. That's much cheaper, 5 times cheaper. Big one is 20 tons and yeah, I tried that, but yeah, okay, maybe next time. Top try. She's doing a pineapple. How are you? How old? How are how I am? Thank you, good. You? How are you? Oh. Oh, what do you think? How old me? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds it, huh? Uh... <laughs> Your boyfriend, fan? Fan, boyfriend, girlfriend? Yeah. No. Yeah. No? 
Miami, Miami fan. My sister and my ah brother. Ah, oh, family. Yes. Hmm, sister and brother. Yeah. Miami fan, huh? Fan? Me? Okay. How old? Samsip? Samsip. Ning. Say? Samsip. My say? I guess the age of them. <laughs> yeah, 8,000 kids. It's uh, huh? Zip. Zip, Zip, my child. Ying. Zip, Zip. Ying. Twenty-three. Yeah. My child. Twenty-three. Twenty-three. Yeah. Some Zip, some. Maybe not in that noise. Zip, Zip. Ye Zip, some. Ying, my. Oh. Sao. Sao. Sao B. Sao P. Are they Sao P, my God? Sao P is 20 years. 20? 20 years. You 20? Ying. Oh. She? How old is she? 30. 30. 30 years. Yeah, I was right. 30 years old. No party tonight. Party? Have club? You are married? No, I'm not married. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> not married. Not. Oh, later maybe. Later. Oh. I was one time before. What? Before one time. What? Ten year. Zippy. Zippy. Yeah. <laughs> America. <laughs> but now Europe, Germany. Yeah, a little bit more. Sometimes 35, sometimes 40, sometimes 29. <laughs> okay, joking. Ah, okay, I have a little bit more. But 35 people believe it's okay. <laughs> Every year we get younger. She's 20 only, wow. I guess she's 10 years older, 11 years even. She's 30 and he's 23. That's Vietnam people, they immigrated to Laos. Lao life. The hammer, side to cow and some fruit to offer. I'm on the way to the embassy, I have to print something. Opposite of the embassy is a printer woman. She looks beautiful. So <laughs> it's worth to go there and <laughs> to have a print. Only because of her look. Anyways, it's not because of that. <sighs> Seriously. <laughs> but there's a big but. I couldn't find any other print shop. So I have to go from the bus station, where's my hotel, to the embassy where her printer shop is but she's not the youngest lady so I'm thinking about going to Paxe in the south of Lao and then maybe to the 4000 islands yeah I really hard to think about that but it's not planned yeah probably next time yeah Probably next time I do that. Good luck, the embassy opens again. Yeah, it's one hour waiting time now. I just have a sugar cane juice from these ladies here. <coughs> Near the street, it's a mother, she's 40, she told me, and one daughter is 16, and the other is 19 with a brown long shirt. The red shirt is 16, and they have a big dog there. 
I see below the feet of the 16 year old one, she's preparing the sugar cane. Yeah, it's maybe 500 meter before the embassy, the Thai embassy. Yeah, make a stop here, they have nice roots here. The melon, sugar cane juice, coconut. Yeah, all possible fruits you can ask for. I recommend you make a stop here. Yeah, I just got a visa. Going to the bus station, heading back to Mugdrahan. Maybe I get a chance to, uh, to go for the big Buddha. Yeah, I'll just will do that. And yeah, maybe later. For the next time, the 4000 Island sounds interesting. In the south of Laos. Yeah, that's a good idea for the next time. Later, Vietnam. Been to Vietnam 12 years ago, changed a lot to my third. Still many motorbikes, but not so many motorbikes like 12 years ago. Alright, heading back to Mokta, Thailand. Yeah, so here you see on the left side now, there's a Thai embassy. Huh? Yeah, now no people anymore. They all pick their visa too, and the most jump in the bus. Oh, back to the hotel. Yeah, the ticket is 13,000 kip. That's one euro and fifty, or probably one dollar and sixty cents to Mukhtahan. Yeah, that's only 15 kilometer around. On the other side from there, I have a bus ticket. We don't want to go Asia to Bangkok. Just waiting here now after I pass the Lao border in front of the bridge okay it's still blau here yeah, but i mean after i pass the pass control i have to wait for the bus because the bus was so full many people used it so waiting for the next bus probably one hour i hope i get a time to visit the big water just crossing the Lao border. Yeah, left side. So when I get right side, move down Thailand. It's getting dark now, slowly but sure. It's 7:29 p.m. And in a half hour, the bus will come to Bangkok, and finally uh, driving back. Really hot here. They only have some. When G ladies, only some, not on every part they have it. On some parts, oh, it's really hot here. Time that the bus is coming. All right, so finally I'm in the bus, and yeah, it's nice air conditioned here. I'm happy. Okay, <laughs> having a nice time now. <laughs> Seeing my girlfriend again, and Bengal, Pattaya. Yeah, they are definitely back for 4000 Islands next time. Oh yeah, nice fresh air here and cool.